today we're going to be talking about uh, the styrene range of edge trimmers. Now as every woodworker knows, any piece of furniture that you make that has a 90 degree edges on it, all those edges have to be dubbed over or arised or sanded over so that they're not remaining sharp. That's true for anything that you make out of wood. That's where the Starim edge trimmers come into play here. We have three types here. One is the ceramic type, which has a ceramic cutting blade, very handy for ABS edging, PVC tape, etc. Then we have um, two steel types here, and they have a steel blade there, which is also resharpenable. You resharpen it just by rubbing it on your sharpening stone like that and this one's called the grip type it's just a bigger version of this more ergonomic in your hand and if you have to do a lot of this stuff this might be a bit more comfortable now i'll just demonstrate these on some different materials and we'll see how they go the ceramic edge trimmer is most useful used on abs edging like this which is applied to this 16 millimeter particle board here now as cabinet makers might know this particle board is the material that uh, most of the kitchens, wardrobes, fitted kitchens, etc. Um, the carcassing is made out of this particle board and every piece of particle board has this um, edging applied to it, uh, which then needs to be cleaned off. So the first thing I use is the square trimmer here. The, the cut is perfectly 90 degrees, so I use that. There are two blades, so you can go either way. And if you look, it's cleaned off the edge nice and square. It's taken off the bit of glue that was also making the edge look a bit dirty. So now you have a perfect 90 degree edge there. And even though the chamfer is so small, it really makes a huge difference. And that sharpness is gone completely. It's very, very smooth and clean. And I haven't got any 0.6 with me today so i'm gonna go straight to the one millimeter chamfer here and show you how that works this is the most popular one actually because the edging is one millimeter and with that you can really see how this cutter works so as you can see very very clean perfect 45 degree chamfer and very smooth to the touch and safe. Now normally um, you would use a, a chisel or a planer blade to do this and then you'd have to file the sides down. It takes a long time and also you have the danger of the chisel or the planer blade digging into the, the board here. This edging here is um, just the stick on edging and that's 0.3 mil. So the 0.3 mil ceramic edge, edge trimmer is perfect for this. I've done that very slowly there for the uh, benefit of the camera, but you don't actually have to go that slow, you can go a little bit faster. So the next one is the steel type trimmer. I prefer to use a 0.6mm chamfer because I find that the 1mm sometimes with Australian timber, it tends to dig out a bit more, so I usually go with a 0.6mm on Australian timber at least, and you can see what it's doing there. if you can see that clearly but it's very very smooth now and it's done a very nice job of that this is a bit of spotted gum now if you wanted to increase the chamfer then i would go to the one mil and i'll use the one mil grip type here to just show you how that one works i hope you can see that edge now as compared to the other edge which hasn't been done so you can see the difference and I'll do this edge for you as well and let's see how it goes with the one mil straight onto the spotted gum see this is what I mean about the one mil you can see it digs out a little bit there and that's what I mean about the one mil and that's why I prefer to go with the 0.6 mil first or even the 0.3 
and if everything goes well with that, then I'll go with the one mil and clean it up. This is a bit of Jarrah worktop. This is the 0.6 mil grip type. Very nice. Keep an eye on the grain, seeing which direction it's going in. So that's the 0.6 mil. Quite well, so I can go with the 1 mil now. We have a beautiful chamfer there. So there you have it, the Star M edge trimmers. As you can see, they're very easy to use. They give you a very precise and clean edge and it saves you a lot of time. So in my opinion, it's an essential bit of kit. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks a lot for watching.